couple of us. But some people are super spread out. Charlie living in San Gabriel Valley, he wasn't able to uh, to travel to as much locals, but now he's going to every single one. Oh, and, and now it also helps him out that he drives. Yeah, now he's going to every single one because he drives. So first match is going to be Greninja versus Palutena, Species versus Mar Mariquas? Mariquas? Mar yeah, yeah, yeah. Mariquas. Anim Anim animals Mariquas. versus Mariquas. All right, so first, first match going to start on PS2, standard usually. What can you tell me about this matchup? I'm going to be real with you. This is really difficult for Greninja. But it's it's also like a matchup where if Greninja plays is very grounded, yeah, uh, it'll work out in his favor. I've seen this a couple times with Venia over in the East Coast. He has to play this matchup very grounded. Yeah, so uh, Palutena is really, really good at catching people's jumps, specifically with the with the Nair. Like, if you jump preemptively, you're going to get hit by Nair. Yeah. So a lot of characters that are very jumpy and very antsy, it's really hard for them to approach. Or yeah. to, to kind of get their composure and to realize, I need to stay grounded, because this game is like all about jumping. Exactly. And like, the thing about Greninja is that when it comes to the air-to-air, -air, he doesn't have much. Like He will have no. to approach, I think his best option that I've seen so far um, is raw back air. And even then, like, oh Ooh, no. SD is first stuck. No. I respect though, because like he wanted to avoid explosive flame, yeah. but at that point you might as well just get hit by the nair strings. Nerf? What nerf? Oh yeah, gonna do the forward tilt. What's he gonna do on the ledge? Down tilt. Of yeah, course. down tilt forward air. So he's doing a lot of very standard Palu stuff. He's do going for the down tilts at the ledge. He's going for fares, nairs a lot, and he's just he's playing really really consistent and solid. Yeah. And. Um, Animals, the Greninja, I believe. Um, I know, I know Greninja. Uh, a lot of his approach options is going to come from like aerials or near. But I know dash attack is also a really, really good combo starter, and yeah. it's really good for leading to like other potential juggling options. Mm -hmm. So I would like to see him do a lot more dash attacks. He can also like grab dash attack, up tilt. Those are really good options. Uh, like I mentioned earlier, like in the air to air, Palutena yeah. is winning. The only move Greninja has to oh kind of combat God. that the might dash be dash attack. Kind of stuff out his uh, his short hop. Yeah. That was really good. He can only use like things like raw back air or yeah. a forward air if he spaces it correctly and even then it's still too slow on the start up. Yeah. Oh my god. Uh, species is having a or animals is having a really hard time uh, getting into the getting onto the stage. Ooh, really good reaction on the shield. Yeah. A lot of people in this game tend to like kind of hit the shield just because they feel like they're safe all the time. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's really good that he he uh, recognized that he shielded and he grabbed him immediately. Yeah, and I tell people as long as your like move is like anywhere from frame five to seven, roughly like anywhere from I, seven's kind of pushing it, but anywhere from like seven, be anything below seven frames, it's pretty safe on shield. Anything that's above seven, you might want to worry about it. Yeah, and jump squad being three frames, making it extra safe. Yeah. Ooh, really good attack again. Yeah. Oh, yep. Back air. Wow. And you even look at Ninja's like a skinny hurt box. Like he still got hit by that. Yeah. I. I. Um. A lot of people in disadvantage when they're getting juggled on onto the corner. A lot of them are gonna throw out an aerial and then try to land. But uh, Muddy was uh recognizing that and uh, waiting for the down air in in the beginning or the up air. Okay. I. I do know that Marigos is actually a, um, God, he's, hold on, hold on. I just see it in your shirt. Marigos is actually a Smash 64 player. 64, yeah, that's what that's what people were talking about. Yeah, Anyways, yeah. Anyways, uh, not an INS anymore, it's Bob Frank now. Um, but yes, uh, we were talking about how they took a long time in the stage selection screen because they couldn't find Dreamland. And then they had to be like, <laughs> no hey, bro, that's Yeah, no <laughs> Pikachu, no Dreamland, you know. That's yeah, funny. so this is game two, right? Yeah, game two. All right, so yeah, we... Game one going to Marie Gless, and unfortunately Animals was in game, game one. Yeah, I know. Um, honestly, we were talking about this because Juchan and uh, Smoothie from UFC, they're both Palutena players. They were talking about how Greninja's kind of tougher Palutena, so let's hope that Animals can uh, adapt a little bit, find those options that make it a little bit harder for Palutena to, mm -hmm. to approach. See, I, it's not that I play Palutena or anything. It's just I've seen this matchup over in the East Coast. It'll usually be like Vinia versus Gen. Oh, right. Yeah, like in those situations where like it's just, it's the East Coast does have like a proper Palutena. It all depends. Like Greninja has the ability to combo Palutena, but also like when it comes to the air-to-air, -air, he has to make those hard call-outs. Oh, yeah. I think it comes down to like Greninja being able to throw some stuff in Palutena's shield. Yeah. She can't really do much about it because, I mean, she can air, but 
he is so fast. So fast and so, like he's just crouching. Yeah. He's got like a spine problem or something that works out for him. <laughs> he, um, he's, he low profiles, he's dash attack low profiles, yeah, some exactly. of his options. So some of those options should give Palutena a lot of trouble and that force smash is going to take the first stock. Animals finding his footing in this game too. Yeah, this time not going to lose that stock as he did. That's what kind of happened last game. He lost his stock to an SD. Oh no, he already re the ledge. He lost it to an SD trying to avoid the uh, explosive flame. You know, you can you can really tell that the smash fundamentals really carry over the game. So yeah, man. In this game, they have two. They have four specials and not two. A lot of people actually don't know. Sixty four only has three. No, sixty four only has. Oh yeah, three. Yeah, yeah. Sixty four only has two, so you only get up special and down special. No, and side special. There's no side special sixty four. Oh, the neutral special. Sorry. Yeah. 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 No. Whoa, he died. Okay. <laughs> um, side B gonna take it. Explosive flame. Um, Animal's gonna have to put in some work in this last talk if he wants to stay in winner side of bracket. Yeah. Looking really tough for it. To puts him all the way to the other side of the corner here. It's a really good job of Arch, Arch standing like, you know what, if I give Greninja an inch, I'll take a mile. And I'm not gonna let him try to fight himself back to center stage. Oh, yeah, too bad. Really backers. walling him out with these aerials. Now he's got a ledge. Terrible position to be against Palutena for that. Down smash, luckily, just putting him back in neutral. And now, Animals is the one. <laughs> oh no, he's good. He's good. Yeah. Up there, he'll be fine, even with the second stock. I think it's up to Animals to kind of understand. Like, the one thing we don't see him toss out, and I respect it too, because of the fact that Palutena has a reflector, is the Shurikens. Yeah. He can force Marigos to start making aerial approaches from there, and then call him out on the air to air. But I understand. He's really hesitant yeah. with the reflector, and that back air will cause hesitation to be a loss. Yeah. When you're that high of a percent, like, just trying to adapt, you, you're kind of just thinking of survival more than yeah. those things. That's your, that's your most, like, it is an animal instinct, no pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, good stuff to Mariguas, um, showing that he is not a one-trick pony. Mm-hmm. Coming into I don't know who, you can't ask me this, because I actually don't even know who he made on 64. I know, it's probably, like, well, Pik Pikachu, Yeah, Yoshi. yeah, so since he picked Palutena, we know that he's smart enough to go for the good characters. So it's either Pikachu or Kirby. Yeah. Yo, man, look, I'm gonna be real with you guys. Both? Oh, Okay, yeah. it's Pikachu and Kirby? All right. I'd, wait, is it? Well, PSI guy says he plays both. Yeah, yeah. So I believe really PSI smart. guy, he, like, knows everything. He's, like, he's like the actual IRL Smash Pokedex. Smashpedia. <laughs> yeah, he's a Smashpedia, the Smash Pokedex. The goal is to get good enough that someone will make a Smash Wiki page on you. Huh? Oh, my.